What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma and wherever you may be and however you may be watching, thanks for making this video a part of your day. So it's about that time. It's time for a Survivor Series as you can see down there in the bottom left. It is the November pay-per-view. That's where we're at. We got 86 stars and uh, Road to Glory. A lot of people have been saying they've had problems with Road to Glory, um, but I've been able to get into matches without a problem. So we might uh, record some of that stuff. We'll definitely do the uh, pay-per-view event, try to get that old snakehead. That'd be kind of cool. Um, we spent some VC on... on uh, we had three attribute points, and we put all of them into toughness. So we were a little bit stronger. Toughness increases hit point recovery and durability. So that that's helpful that we can get beat on a little bit without... Um, a whole lot going on, but we got 15,000 VC, so we're going to hit the loot crate store and open up five silver loot crates. Um, we opened up a bronze. I was playing some Road to Glory a little while ago. We got masks, and I went in, and it just wasn't the mask we wanted. So we're going to go, and it was a bronze case too, so I don't know. Let's open up silver case number one. Okay, we got a red. That's good. Got goatees number two. And we got 2,500 VC. Not bad. I did, Man, I opened up one of the gold loot cases and got another 12,000 VC or something ridiculous. All right, no reds. That's all right. We got grapple moves 78, so we'll check that out. And we got 625 VC. Oh, man. We need VC in this one or we're not going to have enough to open one more get that how that happens one red that's good 1200 vc and we get some more tights and last one for the silver loot crates let's get some masks come on masks come on no reds that's all right thousand we get mark henry outfit and enzo amori bottoms and power moves 110 okay so Let's go into the move set and see what we got. All right, so here we are. Let's hit the new items. We got the Buzz Killer, which is a submission move, which we are not going to use. The Calf Crusher, another submission move. Chicken Wing Gut Buster. Yeah, we're going to use that for sure. We'll buy that. The Oklahoma Slam, uh, that's getting out of the cell. Oh. The Pedigree... Pedigree. Yeah, we're going into SummerSlam. We're going to buy that, too. And the Pele Kick. Mm. We'll go ahead and buy the Pele Kick. All right, so let's go into our special moves and our finishers. We'll take the Coast to Coast off and choose the Puma Pedigree. That's nice. And out here, too, we'll choose... The Puma Pedigree. Bam. The Puma Greet. Nope, that sounds dumb. All right. We'll change this one to Pop-Up Cutter. We'll switch them up on the outside here. Oh, the Pimp Drop. What's the Pimp Drop? Oh, just like a Death Valley Driver. Okay. All right, so we're going to accept that. We Let's go to... I'm, I'm going to guess the Pele Kick is a Strike. Let's see if they if it even let us have it. If it's not a okay, cool. There it is. So we will re remove the drop kick and get the pele kick. Damn, what was the other one that we just unlocked? Oh, the chicken wing gut buster. That's a strong grapple for sure. We'll get rid of the sit out um, thing. Oh. No? Maybe... Oh, no, that's rear. Oh, maybe it is rear. Yeah, we can get rid of that. We're too big f or too small for that. There it is. All right. So we're going to have to push him around a little bit and get that. We've got the inverted Frankensteiner, Oscar, and the Summer Crush. Oh. All right. 
So there we go. We got the pedigree, the Puma pedigree. We got the Pele kick and the chicken wing gut buster. Let's get on a Survivor Series. All right, here we are in the backstage area. It is Survivor Series. Now, you guys didn't see this, of course, because I cut it out, but saw you working late the other night at the gym, prepping for the pay-per-view. I dig that. I'm sure you'll kill it. Thanks, Mark. You're a, a nice guy. Um, my whole game just freaking crashed, so I had to restart everything, reboot it all up. Oh, what a pain. All right, Apollo, what you got to say, man? That interview was crap, by the way. It won't let me fight him. I don't think it was. I actually don't even remember what interview he's freaking talking about. All right, let's go. Let's go see if Vince is around because we get a buff if if we talk to Vince before a match. So let's go see if he's out. Gary, my man, what's up? Nobody in catering. We got Grand Metalik and Chad Gable over there. A superstars persona, yeah, okay. Oh, Bailey, S hiding behind the crate. Bailey, we haven't talked to you at all. Love the ending to your interview. Ha! <laughs> I want to, I want to say we got into a fight. I'd have to go back and look. WWE Universe, is, don't worry about it. All right, Vince, you here at Survivor Series? Of course not. Of course not. Let's go talk to Steph. Let's assume she... Okay, she's not even in here. So, Steph said some stump stuff about good luck on defending the or uh, cashing in the money in the bank. Kind of threw me. I, I don't like it. Dash, my man. I still believe in you, despite the fact you keep failing. Uh. Okay, Mick's moving a little bit around. Nope. Busy as always, apparently. All right, Todd. Pay per view time. What's in it for us, man? You know, we're Mr. Money in the Bank and the United States Champion. The moment of truth, my man. Is he out there right now? Oh, he's out there, all right. Trying to harness the tides of fortune against you. Don't got to tell you, but this is no normal match. This here is a big deal. We've done a lot. Let's not leave the fans waiting. Time to rip him from his throne. He's occupied my throne long enough. Yes, sir. Past time. A change is coming to the WWE, and it starts with you. He just now defended the title, so he's ripe for the plucking. It's your time. Feel that competitive zeal. Take what's yours. You got it. You got it, man. Always doing this for myself. I'm dedicating this one to you. Since uh, we're kind of a company, man, we're, like always, I'm doing this one for myself and myself alone. All right, let's go. One day you'll look back and smile. Now go on and change the world, sport. Oh Jimmy man, here we go. But look who's coming. I have a feeling someone He's not ready for old CM Puma, money, money in the bank, bank contract, contract holder. holder. The no way, but I believe we're Ring the, the bell, because we're about to get it in on Samoa Joe. Not happy with this at all. Of course not the Randy Orton. Wait a minute. No. Oh, Superstar may have just saved Rit the champion's title. Oh, you son of a bee. It did. Randy, no. The champion. Oh, my team. gosh. You were our brother. Unsuccessful attempt to catch you were our brother. The the oh, my gosh, Randy Orton. You pile of garbage. Oh. Jeez, Todd, tell me what happened out there, man. Never guessed he would have turned on you like that. I don't know what to say. That's just cold-blooded. I Vengeance is coming for him now. I'm going to become vengeance itself and hunt him down, and this will not go unanswered. We're about to destroy Randy Orton. Take a breather first. This is going to be an insult to injury, but Vince wants you to talk to Renee about this. I know that's not something you want to do, but he still calls the shots, and I agreed it was best you get over there. Screw everyone, I'm going home. All right, I actually do want to talk to Renee. We got some stuff we need to vent on. I know you're sorry, Todd. I know you had nothing to do with that, right? Okay. 
All right, I know you had nothing to do with that, Todd. Gary, my man Webster, you see what they did to me? Oh, you see what they did? Randy Orton turned on me. Oh, that is freaking heartbreaking. Welcome we back go. to the show. Let's Crazy turn of events have caused a complete reversal for you. What's going through your head right now? I don't know what to think. Um, I don't need this. I quit. Holy cow. But I need time off to reassess. Oh, man. I don't want to quit, but let's quit. Let's see what <laughs> Renee, I can't even begin to describe how pissed off I am. I simply don't have the words. The ones I do have are something you'll have to bleep, so I'll try to hold myself in check. But still, what the hell? I put my body on the line night after night after night. I'm the hottest thing in WWE. My briefcase was ready to propel me to the sky, and this happens? Randy, you son of a bitch. I'll tell you what. You don't need... I don't need this. I don't need any of this. So good news, losers. I'm out of here. I quit. So that's where we are. Ready to get oh, man. I thought that was pretty straightforward. Boom is not happy. That's what we've come to expect. Ugh. I'm just wrecked right now. Let's see what these people backstage got to say. Anybody chowing down? No. Enzo. Enzo, my man. My brother. No, I mean, you're the only one back here. So, oh, I need you. Wow, I'm speechless. You, you are. Me too, Enzo. I just. Man, Big Puma's going. His paint's going to run. Oh, gosh. Let's get out of here. I'm leaving. Braun Strowman, my friend. Help me, my man. Even superstars get backstabbed. Sad but true. How? Oh. All right. Can you please bring my Honda Accord around? Thank you. One month later, it's January. Vince. Oh, God. Glad I caught you. I'm standing in your office. I feel that, quite frankly, your, de your decision to return has been the best you've ever made in your career. Every man and woman faces huge upsets like you experienced, but it's truly the realist who push through those vicissitudes. In the end, I wanted to make you proud. I won't lie, this was a difficult decision, but I came back in order to make you proud of me. The tale of the prodigal son returning. I'm going to take Triple H's place, Vince. I'm going to put in every effort to become the superstar you want me to become. Well, I have to say I do like a happy ending. Truth makes the best angle. That's an adage I've always believed in. And that, man, if you've watched any kind of wrestling in the last 20, 25 years, that is absolutely true. From the standpoint, I appreciate you telling me that. And in turn, I'd like to tell you I'm honestly that I'm happy to see you here. Well, thank you, Vince. What do you do? To, oh, man. Try harder for the title. I need to exact my revenge. I've been stewing in my own rage for a while now. And exacting my revenge sounds... Perfection, a healthy appetite to be sure. I laud your focus. Now that you're back, though, you'll need to push your way back into the title scene. Drop by the general manager's office to figure out what is needed from you there. Thank you. I won't let you down. I'm sure you won't. won't. Oh, y'all. Vince McMahon just called me son. Vince McMahon just called me son. Oh, thanks, Dad. Thanks, Papa McMahon. Let's go talk with Stephanie. That rotten bee. She freaking ruined everything. Finn Balor. Hey, man, we haven't talked to Finn Balor. Let's see. Well, well, well. Look what the mangy ass cat dragged in. Are you for real? Fight him. Oh. What a dick. Grand Metalik. Uh, okay, you know what? Um,. Paul Heyman has said that to me a few times. There's never anybody in this locker room. Why is it even here? Hey, Bertha. Let's go talk to Steph. Anybody in catering? Big ass? Yeah, we don't need to talk to you. All right, let's get over there. Oh, it's Emma. It's Emma. Hey, girl. How is the sudden vacation emo kid? What the... F why is everybody being an asshole to seeing Puma? Stephanie, I don't like what you did. And there he is. I can't tell you how great it is to see you back. Okay, 
Who are you and what did you do with Stephanie McMahon? Relax, I might bust everyone's balls 99% of the time, but this is that 1%. Be thankful. Oh, I'm thankful. The roster's where you belong. and You had a few setbacks, but the fact that you're here means you understand they aren't permanent. I believe you're still our guy, and, I'm, and so I'm about to tell you something I would tell very, very few people. You have the green light to do whatever it takes to get back in the title scene. Ooh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to shake some things up. I would never risk the 1%, Steph. Oh, man. Does that... I mean, can we just start fighting people? Are we still the United States champion? Let's see. Your t-shirt... Oh, yeah, we know that. We know. Double, oh, and I got ripped out, ripped away from my title. Now it's, now it's given to freaking John Cena. But I, I think I just saw we had some attribute points. Of course, it doesn't matter. We don't have any VC, so never mind. Where am I going here, Todd, my friend? All right, let's see. We can't run in on any of these matches. Oh. Oh, Miz, we hardly knew ye. You're about to get killed. What? Jeez. All right, Todd. My man, wonderful to see you back. It's been a while. Man, been way too long as far as I see it. Not the same with you running around making my life a living hell. Hey, now, that's too much. Nah, it isn't. You left on me, so now you're going to get an earful. You got emotional. You let your ire get the better of you. And that's how it always is with you, getting wrapped up in that messy head of yours. Now listen up. You're disrespectful. You're selfish. You're obnoxious. You step on my toes. You ignore my authority or even my suggestions. You cut a promo when I say no. You fight when I say go home. And I need you to take that in so you'll understand exactly what I mean when I say I missed you. Oh, shit. Can't say I say this. Can't say the same. Damn, ice cold. It's because I'm the producer. Let's cut the formalities. Time for you to earn your keep. Mike is piping hot in the WWE Universe. Chomping at the bit. All right, let's get this promo done. Oh, this should be good. CM sure Puma's back, WWE ladies and gentlemen. To know what's going on. I hear the Royal Rumble's coming up. The champ just can't get rid of me. Um, I'm back and coming for that title. I'm back and I'm here to stay this time. And right off, I want to say something that's been on my mind since I've been gone. I'm still coming for that title. It hurts. That I got screwed over my first time at it. But if anything, that has strengthened my resolve. It makes me realize beyond doubt, this is what I want. Um, I don't want to join up with anybody. Let's do this. Ugh. Bulletproof or Bullet superstar. Dodger. Give me whatever nickname you like. I remain a hard person to kill. My will makes me invincible. And my tenacity makes me a bitter, bitter enemy. The champ thought I was gone. But now he's going to see... What it's like as I haunt his every move like a bloodthirsty revenant. Holy moly. There's reason the lowest pit for traitors. Uh, I won't fail. There we go. My next shot is not one I'm going to fail. I know what that's like. I left a bad taste in my mouth. And I won't put myself in that a position to experience that ever again. It seems to me you can view life as win versus fail or win versus learn something. I learned a hard lesson and being away from you guys... Made me feel it. All right. Um, let's try this one. Nice. Out of the ashes of my defeat, I am rising as a stronger competitor. As I double my training and efforts and passions, I dare say the strongest competitor. That is something our champ cannot admit for himself. He got soft in his victory. The same way he's become soft by hiding behind the backs of other people. Oof. No rest for the wicked. Here we go. Let's try that. Okay. So, champ, wherever you are and whatever you're doing, now hear this. Prepare yourself to take the fall. Do the job. You enjoyed your throne for long reign, longer than anyone thought was going to happen when I came for you. But now I know who is defending you, and I won't let them distract me from our rematch and see in Puma's rightful place on the Iron Throne. Not sure what to make of that, but... Okay. Man. That's what we've come to expect from okay, 138. Not bad. I mean, we got what we needed. Todd, what what do you got to say? You haven't lost a beat, have you? Of course not. I come out here, and I'm coming to get my title, and I'm going to let anybody know 
that we deserve it back. Man, I know I said it before, but great to have you back. Felt like there was a gaping hole in the show. Well, I mean, of course, there just that just makes sense. Freaking Mick Foley. I wish I could put a, a chair right across your goofy dome. Steph, did you leave? Of course she did. You didn't even see my promo. Let's get out of here. Cedric? My dude, what's up, man? The Royal Rumble should be quite a bloody affair. Okay. That is a weird thing to say. You know that pay-per-view that's coming up? Well, yeah, maybe the Royal Rumble. Roman Reigns, you doofus. All right, let's get the car. That is going to be it for this episode, I think. We did uh, two weeks. We did Survivor Series. Come on, Puma, get it, get it together. We did Survivor Series. Um, Randy Orton turned his back on us. That son of a bitch. That dirty snake. And Samoa Joe is still your champion. We split. We just left the WWE. Came back. Vince called us son. Oh, man. And then Steph said, do what you got to do. So, all in all, kind of a, a slow episode, but it it did accomplish a couple of things. So, we're going to end it here. Come on back. We got the Royal Rumble coming up. It looks like it's coming soon. Still got weeks two and three before that, and let's see what's in store for us in those weeks. Thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not. It's January, baby. It's WrestleMania season. I'll see you soon.